exchanged from the fireplace factory currently at a customer's home and um, they've purchased the bespoke 1170 because they wanted to do a slim lamb easier wall now i'm going to show you it on their wall here on the back they've got a depth of let's just have a look they've got a depth of the wall of just touching over 13 inches but they didn't want to come out too much into the room so they've gone for the slim line fire and they've gone for the bespoke 1170 with a 50 inch tv so i'm going to spin that around and show you in a second the good thing about the bespoke 1170 is the depth of it it's only 185 mil it's just touching over seven inches so if you can imagine let's have a look 185 that's what you're going to lose into the room even if you've got a small apartment, whatever size living room, if you're building on the front of an existing chimney breast, it's easy to put seven and a half inches on there, as opposed to one of the panoramic fires, which is uh, 330 mil. So you're looking at about 13 and a half inches, which is nearly double the depth. Um, so let's spin this around for you. There we go. So as you can see, customers gone for either side. They've gone for three shelves either side we've got a 50 inch t 50 inch tv we've got a soundbar shelf and then the 1170 itself has been fitted now when you get your when you're looking at the dimensions of the fire on the actual website you'll notice you will have the dimensions for the viewing screen and then the overall box so these are the parts of the fire that you don't see your plasterboard sits flush on there how it stays in the timber structure is either side you've got these screw holes so you've got three on one side and then you've got three on the other that's all done now that's ready the plaster is going to come in tomorrow so it's getting plastered tv brackets going up um, the first phase of the electrics has been done that's going to be going there we'd recommend putting probably i don't know two double sockets behind your tv one for your fire tv um, i don't know dodgy box in your sky box whatever you want to do but um, now we're going to come back revisit this get some photos of our customer big thanks to them for letting us in the home and uh, now this is going to look special right catch up with you soon